Okay, I mean, you can hear the thunder. <laughs> yep, you can hear it. But, uh, pan's cleaned and ready to go on. The uh, timer cover, it's clean and ready to go on. You can look at that. Now we're uh, waiting. I can't like cover it up because the uh, clip right here that holds this in right there uh, won't let the cover go on it. But I can put the pan on top of it, cover it. As you can tell, I had that damn thing in there. I, I hit it every time. I know I did. All right, get my flashlight. One of them, five of them things right there. But you can see, I was connected every time on that thing. And right now, it's just a waiting game. We have to wait for uh, that gum. <clears throat> expansion plug for that and the oil pan gasket and the rear main seal I did find that let's get that light again I'll show you you can see that I found out where it was leaking <clears throat> right there it actually pokes out just a little bit there's a defilade poking out so it's not a defilade it's comes out some so that's where that one was leaking I'd probably loosen it up and all that and just push it in there gently, but I'm going to replace it. <clears throat> I'm not even going to chance it and go through all this crap, do it over again. I know the pump works. Apparently, it works really well because it blew that <laughs> plug out. <laughs> it's the plug wasn't in there very well. The plug was just half-ass in there. It should have seated and went straight instead of, uh, well, where are we at? See, every one of these are straight. Well, where's my thing? All right. Right here on the cup. When it goes in there, and if you can tell, there's a little gap right there all the way around it. Well, the same thing with the one that's on the front up here. <clears throat> but the problem is, is he didn't get it in there far enough because it was steel. I mean, it's hard to drive steel in one of these blocks right here. So... Uh, I'm just gonna cover it and wait. It'll probably everything will be here by Friday or Saturday, and then I'll put it all back together. And um, well, I'll be putting it back in the truck come the first of September. Jeez, it's just a pain in the ass. Hmm. Gotta get my cigar on. <clears throat> yes, it has. It's been a pain in the ass. But through all this, I've changed out every one of the sensors the uh, oil pressure, the camshaft, the crankshaft, or the crankshaft, and the NOX. Everything's changed there. And then I have the. Uh, I have the throttle positioner and I have the air which is the air mixture intake air or IR and there they are that's the air right there and then that is the uh, throttle body I mean the throttle positioner so uh, geez. when I get it all back together it'll be good now I hope anyway uh, I don't put that damn thing in there right, correct. Make sure I get it up inside that thing because it should have went in there that far. And according to wherever the hell that damn thing went, I don't remember where I put it. There it is. See, he didn't get much in there. It should have went all the way back to right there, the outside edge instead of right there. So it just got in there. Mm. Now it uh, deformed but they're not supposed to mushroom right here this part and it ain't mushroom and it's doing something else it's where he hit it on the outside and then it folded in it folded around that taper that's what it is it's taper it's an outside taper or whatever yeah but anyhow, uh, I'm almost there. 
Jeez, what a pain in the ass. The tractor runs great. It sure does. Um, and now I want to find, well, I want to get them front uh, rims for it. Uh, with the rims and the cable, the tachometer cable, it's going to be uh, $341.85. That's including shipping, you know, to the house. Uh, I don't know. I got a tooth problem affecting me again. <clears throat> I ain't heard nothing about that, so I you know, just have to deal with it. But I think I'm going to buy the rims and then deal with the tooth later, I guess. If I have to, I'll just stay drunk all the time. I mean, that's what I'm doing now. Beer is the only thing that helps medicate it. Well, I don't get no sleep at night, period, whatsoever. So there you have it. This piece of shit will be back together soon. By God, I hope anyway. I'm getting tired of fucking with it. <clears throat> I do. I really do. I hope. Uh, because I want that truck running. Because I got a toolbox I can put on it out there. I forgot all about my little old S10 uh, Nissan and all that toolbox I had. And that'll make her happy. I'll clean that box up real good. Put that drawer right there back in there. And put that drawer right back in there. And she can just load it down with all the shit she wants. <laughs> Alright y'all, peace. Man, man, new shots, bought and all that other good shit by getting warm. Storm's fixing to come. And good God.